Hey everyone, we're back with our reaction to Season 2, Episode 3 of Blank the Series. Okay, let's start. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm not good. I don't want to do anything, but I don't want to do anything. What do you mean? คุยงานกับหมอหน้าหวานสนุกมากเลยค่ะเขาซื้อหวานนี้ว่าคุยอะไรใกล้กันขนาดนั้นน่ะเนี่ยหนังห่างกันไม่ได้เลยเนี่
ูในทางที่ไม่ดีอะไอหนุ่มก็ไม่เห็นต้องไปสนใจคนอื่นเลยเนี่ยคะ People will talk about you definitely yeah ไม่อยากทะเลาะกับหนุ่มเรื่องนี้นะ so it's okay okay ไม่ช้าก็เร็ว you cannot make everyone happy no that's why it's best to just live your life yeah ช่วงนี้นอนห้องตัวเองไปก่อนนะคะนะนะคนเก่งนะนะคะก็ได้ค่ะเป็นเพราะหนึ่งอ้อนหรอกนะใครอ้อนไม่ได้อ้อนสักหน่อยงั้นเขาขอก่อนอันหนึ่งให้ชื่นใจทีหนึ่งได้ไหมชีอาสเลยชีอาสโอ้ that's so sweet to each other yeah ขอบคุณนะคะ she's trying and auntie is just like Yes, and she is from the older generation, yeah. so you can't yeah, expect her to yeah. just accept right away. Hmm. He's big in the tomboy. Yui, Yui. Yeah, Yui. Yui. Yeah, Yui. 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 She, 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 the way she smiles is so, so in love. Mm-hmm. How does this doctor have so much time off? Maybe she's not a surgeon. It doesn't matter. Doctors have like clinics and you know, private practices. She's not doing anything but shopping and hanging out. ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่
she, and yeah. bites her she bites her nails. Oh. Mm. 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 เคยทะเลาะกันบ้างมั้ยมีสิคะคู่ไหนเค้ามีกันทั้งนั้นล่ะคะใช่ค่ะทําไมเหรอคะเปล่าหรอกแค่มันมีเรื่องมาทําให้
าพอจะเป็นไปได้ไหมคะถ้าเราจะบอกทุกคนไปเลยว่าเราคบกันอยู่ไม่ได้นะทําแบบนั้นบ้านแตกพอดีบ้านเขาเหรอก็ใช่นะสิหนึ่งจำตอนเชษรู้เรื่องยุ้ยได้ไหมก็ช่างสิคะไม่ได้เลี้ยงเขามาซะหนึ่งเอาแจงไม่พูดแบบนี้นะก็มันจริงเนี่ยคะ่ะ But it's true, yeah. It's true, though. Yeah, she's right. Like I understand her. Yeah. I think the only person she should care about is Granny. Yeah. She will. They have to call the hospital. ไม่วันใดวันหนึ่งเราก็ต้องหันกลับมามองความรู้สึกของคนรอบข้างโดยเฉพาะคนในครอบครัวเห็นเข้าใจที่อาพูดใช่ไหม Then you l l never be able to come out though <laughs> Exactly they're gonna be in the closet forever Yeah This granny looks too sweet. I don't know what's wrong with these people. You know, like tomboy. Is it? Is it? Is it really bad dating a tomboy in Thailand? I think it's just. Maybe it could be a translation thing, but I think it's just because you know it's a girl. To that kind of people, wow, that's harsh. Because the granny is thinking about like uh, social status, right? And maybe she's thinking that has something to do with the social status of the girl. I don't know. Well. Just because she's a girl, mainly. It's unnatural. Yeah, a lot of people think that. Oh, man. 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 She's already an adult, and she is in university, and don't get into any relationship. I know it's that's so a little bit. That's a little bit too much. That's too much. It's, a, <laughs> it's unreasonable to think that she's not gonna want to be with someone. Hmm. And it's it's. Hmm. So sweet! Oh my god! Yeah, that's cute. Oh, one. Why is it difficult? What is it? What is it? Just the people in front of us. We don't care about other people. Did you talk to your sister? Did you talk to your sister? Did you talk to your sister? Shinung is happy about that. I'm it. There's no guarantee of that though. No. 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 But it might take a little time. But we won't be able to go anywhere else. Yeah. 
ก็ได้ค่ะงั้นเขาจะรอรอไปกับอนึกนี่แหละคิดถึงนะหนึ่งจังอาร์ตไม่คิดถึงเลย So sweet Oh my god อันนึงยิ่งพูดแบบนี้เขาก็ยิ่งคิดถึงสิคะอาร์ตกำลังนั่งดูรูปหนึ่งแบบนี้เนี่ยคิดถึง Oh the picture That's uh, the grandma Tess Yeah She pick it up and uh, like glue it. It doesn't look like wow. it though. But it's it exactly like... the same picture. Yeah, but it just looks like it was crumpled, and I remember the granny like ripping it up. So what the heck? <laughs> mm. But yeah, the food looks yummy. Yeah, it does. Now I'm hungry. ก็ผมเกรงใจคนหนึ่งเลยครับไปรับไปส่งไปทุกวันไม่เห็นต้องเกรงใจเลยวังหนึ่งก็อยู่ใกล้แค่นั้นเองขอบคุณนะครับผมอ่ะอยากเอาใจลูกแล้วก็อยากสอนลูกขับรถด้วยไอเดียดีไหมครับอยากเอาใจลูกแล้วถามลูกเลยอย่างว่าเขาอยากได้รถหรือเปล่าเขาไม่อยากได้รถเหรอครับ Ask her. หนึ่งหมายถึงว่าแทนที่คุณจะมานั่งถามหนึ่งไหมถามมาหนึ่งดีกว่าไหมก็จริงนะครับ He's really annoying right now. แต่แบบนั้นมันก็ไม่เซอร์ไพรส์สิครับ A little bit. Yeah. บางทีอาจจะไม่ได้อยากได้เซอร์ไพรส์ก็ได้นะ I'm just over like him and Anung's mom. They keep putting Pundun in the middle, like she's supposed to do the parenting for them. Do you know why? Share. Share. Thinks it's a perfect situation because the woman he loves takes care of his daughter, and he would think, okay, this is a perfect woman for me. He's trying to slide in there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Actually, I think maybe he intentionally have Kunna get more involved in it, but he doesn't know. Yeah, but he doesn't know. <laughs> he really enjoys the current situation. I have a daughter and the woman I love takes good care of my daughter. And it would be a perfect family. So did they figure out? <laughs> yeah. Like, uh, did they figure out the situation? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think they. So they are just your friends now. Mm -hmm. ทำไมอ่ะไม่ดีไม่ใช่เหรอคนชอบเยอะๆไม่ไม่อ่ะแล้วไม่ได้อยากดังไม่ชอบเจอคนโอ้หนึ่งขอถามอะไรคุณอย
ันอย่างพูดเหมือนไปรู้อะไรมาเลยนะครับบอกผมต้องตรงได้นะครับสมมตินะสมมุติว่าลูกคุณชอบผู้หญิงคุณจะทำยังไงลูกผมกับเด็กยุ้ยนั่นเหรอไม่ได้นะแมวคุณหนึ่งผมจะไม่ยอมให้ลูกผมไปเป็นทอมดี้อะไรนั่นหรอกนะ You don't let her <laughs> It's not on your decision <laughs> Yeah ซึ่งคุณกับเพียงฟ้าไม่เคยเป็นให้เขาได้เลยลองไปคิดดูนะคนชอบเยอะเลยนะจะให้ไอ้มันไม้กันไหนนานแค่ไหนเนี่ยก็เรื่อยๆอ่ะอ๋อไม่เอาอ่ะไอ้ไม่อยากสวยไหนจะพ
าขอดูมือหน่อยเธอโซ่สวีทของเธอไม่ได้ทรายนี่นะใช่เธอโซ่สวีทของเธอไม่ต้องยกถุงไม่ต้องยกถุงออกแรงเยอะๆตัดเตี้ยๆมันจะได้มีแรงอย่างนั้นแหละอย่างนั้นแหละ Oh my God she get chilly in her eye <laughs> Other branches. Mm -hmm. That looks nice. Mm -hmm. You hold a spoon like this. <laughs> you can tell she is not used to cooking. <laughs> วันนี้เรามีโอกาสพิเศษอะไรหรือเปล่าคะไม่มีหรอกค่ะแค่วันนี้มีแม่ครัวฝึกหัดคนใหม่มาทำอาหารเท่านั้นเองค่ะแม่ครัวฝึกหัดค่ะออกมาเถอะค่ะ Oh she's so cute in the apron Oh my god It's so adorable It would not be bad. It would not be bad. Yeah. Yeah. Because Auntie Nim was there. I know. <laughs> she was the guiding hands. Everything is like hierarchy. People will gossip, definitely. Yeah. Definitely, they will gossip. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's un especially like those, yeah, especially those staff members mm -hmm. in the house. They see a lot of things. Yeah, they gossip. So they're gonna talk. Yeah, they're gonna talk. No, mm -hmm. Oh wow. Mm -hmm. So determined. Yeah. 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 You can see, actually, Auntie Nim really worries about Kunung, and uh, 
she cares about Kunlun's happiness. Yeah. She is. She cares. Mm-hmm. She's probably mm-hmm. like That's why. have she's probably known her since she was born. Yeah. So she sees her as like um even, even like though the she's like grandchild. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Even though there's still like hierarchy there. Yeah, the love is still there though, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why last time I told you, like, Auntie Nim seems like a symbol of the of Kun Yung's grandma. Yeah. Yeah. อันนึงคะอันนึงจะจัดงานวันเกิดที่ไหนหรอคะทําไมหรออยากให้อาจัดงานหรอคะหรอเขาแค่อยากรู้หรือว่ามีเซอร์ไพรส์หรอไม่
นึ่งอยากให้ครอบครัวหนึ่งยอมรับในสิ่งที่หนึ่งเลือกเอาว่ามันน่าจะเป็นจุดเริ่มต้นที่ดีนะแต่นี่มันวันเกิดอันหนึ่งเขาก็อยากอยู่กับอันหนึ่งไงลำพังปกติเขาก็ไม่ได้อยากจะไปอยู่แล้วอะแต่พ่อเราเขารักเรามากนะเขาก็รักอันหนึ่งเหมือนกันอย่าดื้อกับอาได้ไหมคะอันหนึ่งอันหนึ่งก็รู้ว่าเขาแพ้เวลาอันหนึ่งทำน้ำเสียงแบบนี้ขี้โกงนะวันเดียวก็กลับแล้วไปแค่แป๊บเดียวเองเอางี้ถ้าหนึ่งกลับมาอาจจะตามใจหนึ่งทุกอย่างไงจริงนะอืม so there's a secret deal here ไปก็ได้ก็ไม่ได้อยากไปอ่ะเขายังอยู่กับอันหนึ่งอ่ะแหมวันเดียวเองแต่ก็เจอกันแล้วไงคะแต่ถ้าเขากลับมาอันหนึ่งต้องตามใจเขาทุกเรื่องนะทุกเรื่องค่ะโอ้ some decoration some accessory to the phone yeah you two look really good together She's so obviously unhappy. Oh my! I know it's awkward. I know. Yeah. Oh. Look, pass me Oh, they're around the area they they went before. Oh, are they? Yeah, I think so. Oh, I wonder she's yeah, feeling so sour. Yeah, that's why she thinks about it. Okay. Yeah. I know he's trying. I know he's trying. Yeah. Oh, so this is not bad. Happy birthday. 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 Happy birthday.
Oh, it's just a three day? Yeah, because Anna was spending time with her grandparents. And also, maybe that's why she was so sour. She was so sad. Yeah, I thought she was gonna have like a party party. Okay, let's have one. Susan, one good. Susan, one good. Come, Diana. Don't let one. Don't let her. เค้กร้านเนี้ยอร่อยมากคุณหนึ่งต้องชอบแน่ๆเลยตัวเล็กตัดเลยเขาลอกกินเค้กร้านนี้น่ารักดีนะคะคุณหนึ่งน้องแม
Oh god. เขาขอโทษนะคะได้ร้องแล้วนะเขาเสียงยาแล้วเขาจะไม่ทําแบบนี้อีกแล้วแค่หนึ่งปลอดภัยอ่ะก็ดีใจแล้วไม่ต้อง
องตามใจอาสิคะไอโอเคอืมไปกว่ายาโอ้ยชอบสิคะอ๋อไม่อยากอยากอะไรคะอยากให้อะไรกันโอ้ก๊อชอิสก็รู้สึกก็ปล่อยออกมาสิคะโอ้ไม่ก๊อช Wow! Do you need a fan? You did a great job! <laughs> wow! Yeah! Tebak! 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 How can they face him when I stay like this? I couldn't. Thank you very much, one. Who brought one to me. ไม่มีใครเหมาะที่จะเป็นแม่ของอันหนึ่งเท่าคุณหนึ่งอีกแล้วคุณหนึ่งครับผมยังรักคุณอยู่นะอันหนึ่งก็รักคุณมากด้วยน่ารักจ้าฮิสนอตฟอร์เรลไอนิวเอตไอนิวเอตแต่งงานกับผมนะครับไอนิวเอต This guy is crazy. Kuna was like, "I want to be your daughter-in-law, but you want to be my husband." <laughs> He's crazy. This guy is nuts. He has what made no him think clue. Of, what made him think like, "Yeah, this is appropriate for right now." They weren't even talking. He like, has let's get no back together. clue. Okay. As you can hear me, I got really sick. Okay, my voice is gone totally. Mm -hmm. After that, lost the heart scene, love scene, my sickness gets worse. <laughs> oh. And uh, honestly, that's one of that. That's that's my favorite love scene so far. It's it's so natural. And you can see they're so comfortable with each other, mm. and the tension is so great. Mm -hmm. And uh, okay, like previous love scenes, they make me shy, but this one, it tickles my heart. <laughs> yeah, well, you're still shy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So But, you were still shy. Yeah. Yeah, I'm still shy, but it tickles my heart. I was like, "Holy moly, <laughs> holy moly!" It makes me like sweat as hell. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, the way they look each other, the tension is on another level. Mm, they have good chemistry. Like for me, for me, compared to. Compared with like previous love scenes, this one is on another level. Mm. The way they look each other, 
the way they talk with each other, the tone, and um, <clears throat> like the dialogues. Yeah, it's 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 my favorite love scene by far. Yeah, it's great. It's great. Both of them, they did a great job. It seemed a little more natural than the other they ones. They did a great job. Definitely, the um, the sexual tension is unbelievable. Unbelievable. Wow. Wow. My God. I need to take more pills <laughs> after this. My, my throat. My throat. Yeah. My throat. Some, some tea. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah. So what do you think? Um, I think um, the, the, lo the last love scene, obviously. I um, like their chemistry. Mm -hmm. It seems uh, really natural. Mm -hmm. um, and the scene was just mm -hmm. like more real. It wasn't like, you know, sometimes with um, some love scenes, it can be a little awkward or stilted in some kind of way. Theirs was very mm -hmm. natural because mm -hmm. I think the, the actresses mm -hmm. have really good chemistry together. And you can tell that they're comfortable. Yeah. They're, they're comfortable with each other. Yeah. Yeah, this scene is amazing. It's amazing. I usually don't talk about love scene, but this scene is amazing. Yeah, because it wasn't like gross. Mm -hmm. some, like how sometimes um, some love scenes, it's like, okay, mm -hmm. it's kind of just thrown there. Mm -hmm. uh, this one was more, mm -hmm. it was natural. Yeah, it doesn't mean that the previous love scenes are not great. Um, but this one, this one is on another level. Yeah, because it shows yeah. the progression of their yeah. relationship and how close they are. Mm. So, you know, that's why yeah, we feel like yeah, it's a little yeah. bit better than the others. Yeah, it's so great. And uh, also, when Kunmyung said, oh, I cannot live without you. Oh my God, it touched, touched my heart so bad. Mm. It sounds like you give me a punch in my heart. You know? I was like, you must so in, you must be so in love. Yeah, she's fully... Someone like Kunmyung, who says, who says that stuff. I was like, get married, please. Mm. Get married, please. Right now, get married. She's fully given her heart that, to a young now. Yeah. She's like, she's like, okay. She gives Anong every right to hurt her. Yeah, she has that power now. She's, yeah, she exposed herself fully. That touched me because I am not sure. I can do that if I was her. I don't think so. Mm. So, like, fell in love, fall in love at 36 years old. And uh, after so many experiences, after so many um, things, you still, like, be able to open to someone like that. If I was her, I would not do that. Yeah, if I was in my 20s, that's fine. That's okay because, you know, you know what I mean. But Life isn't over when you're in your 30s. 36 years old. But I don't know. If I was her, I would not be able to do that. Like, freshly fall in love with someone and 100%, like, expose myself and uh, give that person, like, every right to her but it's something that she future. craved though because she's never had it yeah yeah i i know i know i know um yeah you should be always like open to love okay <laughs> don't listen to me <laughs> I can't believe you're saying don't listen that. to me always <laughs> like open you're um, saying that. and auntie neem i i am happy i'm happy like auntie neem um understands understands Kunnung and uh she kind of accepted uh Anung in her way you yeah know? and uh yeah in her way and I wish it could be a little longer you know 
a little more like detailed, like more like um, have up and up, ups and downs. But it seems like it's smooth, more smooth than I thought. So okay, but at least there's an end to this. Like okay, Kunneng is able to get some recognition from the older generation,、mm-hmm. even though she was not able to do that from her grandma. Yeah. Okay, but at least she got some recognition from the old generation, and、uh, she's like brave enough to speak out what she feels. And she finally, I believe, someone who's like Kunneng, who's like first born in Asian culture. I understand how much burden she she has on her shoulder,、mm-hmm. you know. And、uh, maybe she was taught to do the right thing her whole life, and、uh, she maybe even taught not to show her emotions in her on her face. To be honest, you know. So I'm happy that she chose to be true to herself. You know, to be honest with herself, like okay.、Um, and、uh, telling Auntie Ning, like okay. Anna is my happiness, and I. Why should I care about what other people think?、Mm-hmm. I'm really happy about her change, and、um, yeah. Of course, they have to deal with Anna's families. Yeah, but they'll figure it out. They'll figure it out. Yeah, they'll figure it out. So, what do you think about the the episode? I like the progression that we see with、um, again with、um, like <coughs> Anung, um, Anung, and、um, especially the the interactions that、um, Anung had with Auntie Nim. I really like that she was putting that effort、mm-hmm. in there because it's not just、um, <coughs> it's not just about the acceptance of her <coughs> in the palace. And in like around the people、mm. there, it's also about being mm. accepted mm. by her because, like we were saying, she's an extension of Kunung's grandmother, right? Auntie Nim has probably been、mm. there since、mm. Kunung was born, maybe before she was born. And even though she, yeah, in their society and the hierarchy of things, she's below her. She's still that grandmother figure in her life, and.、Mm. Of、yeah. course, she loves her, and she probably loves her as if she were her own、mm. granddaughter, because she had a hand in raising her. Somebody in that kind of position, they would have a hand in raising.、Um, so、they're partially responsible for raising of the children in that household. So it's nice to see、mm. um, Anung put that effort into trying to get close to her and having like a special moment of making the meal together. It's it's very normal. It's、mm. almost like something you would do with someone's grandmother.、Mm. You want to make a meal for them, like, "Hey,、yeah. Granny, can you help me like make this meal for your granddaughter? I know she really likes it." So that was really nice. And even though Auntie Nim is,、um, she doesn't approve of their relationship, right?、Uh, maybe she even thinks same-sex、mm. relationships are bad. But ultimately, I think before that,、mm. she's thinking about. Kunung's place in society. She's like, "Hey, you're in this royal family, and this is bad for your reputation." So even though she、mm. wants her to be happy, it's like, "Hey, you can't do that." Like, what are people、mm. going to say about you and your family? And what will it mean for you if people are、mm. gossiping about you? And so,、mm. I think that's like the conflict that she has. But she is from the older generation, so we can understand that.、Mm. But she still does want to、mm. see her happy.、Mm. Yeah, and、uh, yeah, in this episode, Cher is actually the main villain,、mm-hmm. and、um, he seems very homophobic. And、um, and、uh, as a father, I can understand he tried. To get into the life of a nun, but it seems like she's a little, he's a little pushy.、Mm-hmm. 
and uh, he just uh, does it in his own way, his way. Thinks maybe that's also like the best of all known, which is really wrong. And uh, I can tell he he intentionally maybe spread the rumor about him and on、Kunun. the social media about him and Kunun. Oh yeah. yeah! As soon as I saw that, I was like, yeah, that was on purpose. Because he's trying to force her、uh, which, hand. Which, 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 which is dirty. Yeah, yeah, which is a dirty play. And、um, and it gets really clueless, you know. Yeah. You already know what Kunneng. You already. You already. You know. You already know what Kunneng thinks about you.、Mm-hmm. But you still thinks you have a chance. She literally left him at the altar. That's something really. Yeah, it feels like you are hallucinated,、mm-hmm. and、uh, and also you may love you 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 may be you may be a love a nun, but from my point of view, maybe you also utilize a nun, yeah, to get close to to kunung. Yeah, it's like killing two birds and, with one、uh, stone. Yeah, so I was like, <laughs> if he knew, if he knew, yeah, and、uh, I, I, it was the, the situation is really chaotic. Like, okay, Kunun wants to be with Anun, but Anun's father wants Kunun to be his wife. I know, my God, ah, <laughs>、uh, it's so bizarre. Yes, I yeah. Yeah, very bizarre and very awkward. And、mm. uh, so, uh, so what do you think about share in this episode?、Mm. He's a、uh, Mr. Homophobe.、Um, I think that、mm. is also part of、um, that. Probably also has to do with their 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 social status as well, right? Because in their that's just、mm. in society anywhere. When you're in Higher society, or you're an aristocrat, you want your children to marry people in your social circle that are from the same kind of similar backgrounds for you,、mm. right? That's how these people maintain their power because、mm-hmm. they all run in the same circles.、Mm. So、mm. that's also like in his mind, maybe that's something.、Um, That's something、uh, that he doesn't want to deal with because it's like, wait, I'm not gonna have,、um, I'm not gonna see my daughter married off to some, someone in some good family or something like that. And it's also with what、mm. people are gonna say about her and his family. And he's also a politician, so there's that. That can、mm. definitely affect his、um, whether his chances of like election <coughs> or re-election. And of course, that will cause conflicts with the people,、mm. whatever political party he's in, right? Because this can be a scandal. You know, maybe eventually he will be able to warm up to the idea, but he has to be open to first getting to know his daughter because he doesn't know her. He keeps trying to buy her love and attention, and her mother tried the same thing. And、mm. you cannot make up for time、mm. by spending money. And throwing gifts at your kid.、Mm. She's twenty. She has. She's an adult,、mm. and、mm. she has her own ideas. She has her own personality, and you weren't there for twenty years. You can't just expect her to just jump into your arms. So、mm. he has to、uh, overcome this, trying to buy her love, and he's also like using her to get to Kundun too, which is messed up. And he's using Kungung to get to her. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Also, what the heck is going through this dude's mind? Like proposing to her and to Kungung like that. Like, they. I told you he's hallucinated. He has to be because he's hallucinated. They didn't even rekindle their relationship. They had no talks about like,、mm. yeah, we are definitely going to pursue being together again. He kept saying that he was gonna try to get back with her, but she was just like, "Yeah, whatever." 
She never said, yeah, let's do this. Maybe he expects... Maybe he expects Anang would help help him out, like okay, saying like, oh Anang, yeah, do it, say yes. <laughs> he Maybe that's why he oh, does it God. in front of both of them. And she's like horrified. They're both horrified. I don't know. This guy is hallucinated. Yeah, he's weird. Yeah, this guy is hallucinated, and he's 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 like clueless. And uh, this character is 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 a little bit. Off. Yeah, he is. <laughs> he doesn't think rationally, mm. and uh, I don't know. This character was like, mm. there's no development in this character. No, he's also the same, and he's so like clueless. And I don't know how he becomes a politician. You know, he honestly, honestly. He is a little dumb dumb. <laughs> um, yeah, he is. He's a little dumb dumb. Yeah, and he is. I don't know how. I don't know how he becomes a politician. Yeah, well, he's rich, he's so dumb-dumb. and he's from a good family. So, so anyway. Mm-hmm. So anyway, <laughs> okay. Okay, so I'm really looking forward to the next episode, and uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm really looking forward. And um, this month is Pride Month, right? Yeah, because we are in June. Mm. And uh, also, like, um, blank the series, um, the actresses will come to Korea. <laughs> <laughs> I hope I can get the ticket, okay? Lucky. So, okay. Yeah. See you next video. Mm. Okay. <laughs> and uh, take care of your health too. Don't be like me. You get really sick. Yes. Go to bed okay. on time. And uh, mm, yeah. And uh, don't forget to support them. Okay. Mm. <laughs> Bye.